Yeah, we're talking uh, uh, healthy snacks. Uh, this, I want to show you this uh, uh, this uh, list of things that you can put together, a menu you can put together. Carol Dumbrow is a Heart and Stroke Foundation registered dietitian. This is sample menu. These are sample menus. We have five sample menus online, which yeah. gives you breakfast, two snacks, and lunch. And that's the planning you're talking about. That's right. You need to plan. Now, you don't have to do it two weeks in advance. No. But you if can, you can do it a week. You know what? If you could plan two weeks, period, and then repeat it, you'd be doing great. You'd you know, have lots you, of variety. That's right. You can vary the vegetables depending what's in season and the fruit. But you know what? You you pick out your favorite yeah. things and you you can have great meals. Oddly enough, Carol, some of the things we talked about having for breakfast are also great yeah. snack ideas. For sure. Right? For the, sure. the fruit being the key. You know what? Fruit and vegetables, we know that only about three out of ten children are eating uh, five or more servings of fruits and vegetables. So that means seven out of ten aren't. So, right. you know, when it comes to snacking, you want to make sure that fruits and vegetables are there every time. So when you're cutting up your, your uh, fruits for your breakfast uh, parfaits or your smoothies or what have you, cut yeah. a little extra for snacks. Yeah. Right? You know what? Have it in the fridge. It, you know, my thing is have a big bowl of fruit right in the fridge, right front and center, so when your kids open the fridge, that's mm -hmm. the first thing they're going to see. Organizing your fridge is a good idea, right? Oh, for sure, for sure. We did that recently and put the good stuff where you can see it. Yeah, makes mm, a difference. Funny about that, yeah. you know. <laughs> People don't like to go hunting in the fridge. No. <laughs> no. You know, cut up vegetables, having, you know, kids love dips. So, you know, we have hummus here. It could be a different kind of a yogurt dip. But anything you can dip, kids love it. So, mm -hmm. you know, you'll get them to eat a lot more vegetables that way. Now, sometimes the kids want, uh, you know, baked goods and that sort of thing. I noticed one of the tips on the list is to uh, bake some low-fat muffins, freeze them. For sure, yeah. And you pretty well have them instantly, a yeah. little microwave That's and away right. you go, right? Yeah. yeah, very simple. Yeah, and most of these things we see here uh, are portable. So, yeah. if you've got kids that are on the move, going to after-school activities and so on. Yeah. You can fill their bags with good stuff. Yeah, for sure. And so, some kids want to take snacks for recess. Same thing. You know, make sure there's fruits and vegetables. Add some cheese or hummus, some nuts if you can, if you're allowed to. If send you're nuts. allowed, yeah. Um, you know, hard cooked eggs, uh, whole wheat crackers, pita, lots and lots. You know, a yogurt. There's lots of simple, easy things. The biggest thing, as you said at the beginning, is planning. Yeah. But you know, go to the Heart and Stroke. .ca website, you'll find fact sheets, you'll find menus. Sample menus. Yeah. So Look, these menus are right there in front of you. They're right there. They're all linked to, to recipes that we have online. Look for the time to start, which is our back to school campaign. Right. And you'll find all this information there as well. Look at all the different things you can have. Yeah. That's two weeks of stuff right there. Yeah. Without repeating anything. That's right. And it's very simple. All the recipes that we produce are very simple. They all meet nutrition recommendations. The all kinds of recipes and there. Yeah. And mm. they're all kid friendly. I like it. Good. All the hummus, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Can't beat it. A lot of people have hummus nowadays. That's right. A little bit of pita. Yeah. Good stuff. Good. I want to say uh, thanks to you guys for coming in with all that great information. It's really our appreciate pleasure. it. Yeah. Uh, look online, too, for that survey information about breakfast and so on. Very interesting results.